Hello YouTubers, and welcome back to having a blast on Taki on the Fringe. So, uh, now we go with the uh, Bora side of the force once more, and uh, test out our new vessel. So, uh, Kyron Beard is, let's go. Right, and I'm going to imagine... AGT pilot sentenced to exile. Rise and wingmen. Yeah, same deal, nothing in the news. But... I'm now a freedom fighter. So combat training for the Bora. Why, why do I need combat train? Indeed, a regional pass to Bora. So there's no hub escort. Oh well, uh, it's a bit of a bummer. Oh well. You have valid access codes to the Bora Medigate. By pressing accept, the next time you launch, you will autopilot directly to Freedom Starbase in the Bora region. Well, it looks like that's our only. Uh, our only option, combat training, ring training class. It's very insistent that I do that, but I'm not gonna. So, anyways, we get to have a first look at the ship, the Bora Cutlass. Um, yeah, yeah, it looks a bit rusty, but she handles a bit better than that Mako. I'll tell you that. Right, okay. Oh, a lock on one. I'll stick that in there since I've got it in on un unmounted stores. Uh, the arc light laser. Which, um, yeah, it's the uh, borrower equivalent of the glint light laser. I think it's supposed to be slightly more powerful than the glint light laser. Or is it less powerful? I can't quite remember. But anyways, let's, before we go to uh, Bora, let's just stick all the bits on we want. There we go. Right, let's launch. Now here's something you won't have seen yet. It's not very exciting. You do get nice little intros like that. So this is Freedom Starbase. Um, like I say, um, the whole journey there is not quite exciting. I, um, when I first got one of those Mega Gate codes, I was really, really hoping that I'd get to fly it manually into one of those giant Mega Gates, but you, you can't. And that disappointed me a bit, but you know, it, yeah, shit happens. So, job board. Ah, it looks like we've only got one job here. Gate Blueprint. Hi Jake. I got a mission for you. There's an engineer named Dr. McLean who used to work on TCGs for some Soul Corp. Now he's retired and living here in Bora Space. He knows how to fix the TCG to the frontier from the hub. It's not truly broken, you know. Galspan just sabotaged it to make it harder for us to get through to Virtue Station. Anyhow, we have some data that Dr. McLean wants, and he's ready to trade his frontier TCG designs for it. All you have to do is fly out there and get the designs from him, because he, uh, won't send it to us over unsecured lines. Why he thinks our lines aren't secure, I don't know. Your ship computer has all the info he wants, Jake. It's ready whenever you are. Good luck. Lovely. Accept the job. And there's a lovely cutlass again. Just double check that there's nothing, uh fancy about it. No, no, no. That looks like we've got all the bits that we wanted. Right. Let's go. Alright, now let me get this straight. 
I'm going out to trade something with our own guy, right? Mm, not exactly, Jake. Dr. McLean's like you, in that he left the corporations to join us. He immediately started working on decoding schematics of the TCG gates, but communication with him has always been... odd. Okay, so you're sending me to get these TCG plans and find out what's up with this fella? That's the general idea. I'm not very familiar with how corpers think. Uh, ex corpers You know, it would help me to know why this doctor guy left them in the first place. I'll look into that while you head to the Piranhas Nebula. Shit, we're not going to be dealing with a complete loony, are we? Yeah. Similar laser, but in yellow. Oh, look at that. That reflection's pretty cool, actually. Jake, I've got the scoop on the clean. You aren't gonna like it. Lay it on me, Anna. He's kinda crazy. He was an independent contractor for Galspan until his family was killed in a factory accident. He blames the Corpers for their deaths and feels they might be trying to kill him next. His exit examination said he was completely paranoid and delusional. And you guys didn't know this before you invited him to join the family? Oh, I'm feeling a lot of confidence in this group right now. <laughs> That's me, Mr. Confident. Well, he did have the proper anti-corporation mindset. Jesus Christ. This should be fun. Hello, Dr. McLean. This is Jake Logan of the Bora. I need to speak to you. Can I dock at your base? What? What do you want? I see you, Logan, if that's really your name. You stay away from my lab. You hear me? Stay away. Uh, look, 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 Doc, Doc, I'm not gonna hurt you. How did you find me? You must have planted some sort of a tracking beacon on me when I left Galspan. You stay away, or I'll activate my defense grid. Listen, Doc, nobody planted anything on you. I'm your friend. That is exactly what an infiltrator would say. Well, what should I say? Sheesh. Some people. <laughs> oh, great. Hey, you hey, go. you crackpot. I'm from the Bora. Turn off your defenses. Ah! My defense grid is going out of control. You must have sabotaged it. I've been sabotaged. Sit tight, Doc. Your grid must have overloaded. I'll see if I can disable it. Wow, that's quite an explosion. I gotta say, I quite like the nebula effect. It's really quite psychedelic, is it not? You should be safe. Now do you trust me? Well, you can land, but I've got my eye on you. Okay, Mr. Crazy Person Thing. Imagine it's right up here. Fantastic. So maybe you're not a Gals fan, Hitman. 
Are you really from the Bora? Ah, oh, that's what I've been trying to tell you. Now I'm transmitting the data you wanted by hardware. I just need to put it through my viral filters. There. All of this is the information I wanted. Whew. I thought you were a Gauss fan assassin. Yeah, I know. Could you just upload the TCG info we need, please? Of course. Be careful heading back. There are corporate spies everywhere. Uh, thanks. I'm leaving now, so no more surprises, okay? My work here is finished. Yeah, let's go. Before he changes his mind and launches more mines, oh god knows what. relief. I thought it was closed for a minute. Anna, for your information, that McLean, he's a nutcase. He thought I was an assassin and tried to haul me, but I took out the station defenses and got him to transfer the TCG stuff. I'm impressed. You handled yourself like a Bora. Thank you, Jake. I'm glad we can count on you. No problem, Anna. one big starbase. But in this entire game they're all quite huge. Yeah, that'll do. Sorry about Dr. McLean. I guess he was a little more crazy than we thought. Glad he didn't get hurt. These TCG plans look great. One of our technicians is looking over them now to try and figure out what Galspan did to make the gate malfunction. I wish we could just prove to Star Patrol that Galspan does things like this. But Galspan always covers their tracks too well. Commander Obulo isn't interested in finding a reason to have to fight them. Enjoy your credits, Jake. Next time you're in the hub, check at Alpha. I'll keep you updated on the status of the gate repair. Right, okay, so that was our first mission for the Bora. And that was fun, wasn't it? Dealing with a crazy person. Okay, so, new now available. New weapon, Remote Zapper, located at Alpha, Freedom and Liberty Star Bases. Was that another thing that I saw on... Never, never mind, never mind. But anyways, YouTubers, if you have been, thank you very, very much for watching. Give me that. Give me that, 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 give me that